Hello, in this video I am going to show you the steps I took to install a uh, K7 rear view camera on a uh, 2016 Ford Transit 350HD. First we unbox the product. We find some uh, informational material, uh, technical support, uh, some um, basic information regarding uh, install. We have all the materials necessary to uh, wire and install the camera. Here's the uh, suction adapter uh, for the camera stand. We have the camera itself. Finally, we have the cord for the monitor's 12 volt power supply. In the van, I take off the uh, side panels just above the uh, 12 volt power supply from which I will be tapping power for the camera. The red wire is the live or uh, positive wire. The blue wire is the negative or ground wire. First, I need to test and validate that power actually exists on the uh, power terminal. Next, I power up the monitor for the first time. See that it lights up and uh, do some uh, preliminary configuration, such as brightness and uh, display size, those sorts of things. I then continue on working on my electrical connections. Typically the rear view camera is made to work when the vehicle is engaged in reverse. But uh, not this time. The rear view camera will be on all the time while the vehicle is running. This gives the driver a constant view of the rear, which is difficult to do with this larger van. This time I test if there is power on the wires that I just connected. Next, I shall work on installing the monitor. I improvised by installing a plastic base for the suction cup. This base is glued to the windshield with the use of uh, double-sided tape. This prevents the suction cup from detaching from the windshield with uh, changes in uh, temperature between the inside and the outside of the glass. Now 
Now it's time to wire the monitor for power. A 12 volt power supply already exists on the ceiling shelf. All I need to do is uh, install a Y connector from which this monitor will tap its power. display monitor is now installed and wired for power now we need to install the rear view camera while the camera was made for outdoor installation I decided to install it inside the van which will require less cleaning The uh, transmitter is now wired for power and uh, so is the camera. Because of loose plastic which uh, came with the wiring, I need to uh, secure it with uh, foam to prevent it from rattling around behind the wall. Now it's time to put Humpty Dumpty back together again. Now a final check on the rear view camera's operation. <laughs> 